Greetings. Hello everyone, it's Goose. This video takes us to Meade County, Kentucky. I'm gonna show you just a few parts of a video posted online last week of a live and watch what this chief deputy does to these two people just seeking paperwork. What can we help you with? Uh, well, it was at the clerk's office that needs to help me with this stuff. Um, I think they're the ones that called you because some woman just came up and told my clerk to not help me anymore with my record, the business I'm here for. Okay. That's what just happened. So I told her I want to know who she is. We would like to know and who she is so we can follow up on the complaint. Yes, absolutely. Okay. So the reason, probably the reason why they don't want to help you is because y'all got cameras all over there. Well, I tell you what, let's just go oh, to jail then. For this you what? Don't laugh. Don't touch that, me. Hey, that. You just made you messed up. You messed up. You, you want to go to go? I, I would not do that if I were you. What are you going to do? Don't fucking get it. Oh, whoa, whoa. Now you can see the full video listed at the link in the description. Yesterday I tried to call, no luck, answer machine. So I tried to call the sheriff's office again today. I tried four times. On the fifth time, I left a message. You have reached the Meade County Sheriff's Office. Normal business hours are 8 to 4.30, Monday through Friday, Thursdays until 6. If you have reached this message during normal business hours, you are assisting another customer. We will call you back as soon as possible. If this is an emergency, please hang up and call 911. Uh, yes, my name is Goose. I'm a independent uh, investigator with Static and Noise. Uh, that is a YouTube channel. And I have some questions about your deputy who uh, illegally and wrongfully arrested a couple last week in the circuit clerk's lobby. Number one, has he been through the Department of Criminal Justice Training, also known as DOCJT? Has he been through their academy? Number two, if he has... Has he kept up his regular in-service? If he is needing an in-service for next year, as a retired law enforcement officer from the great state of Kentucky after 26 years, I recommend crisis intervention training. That teaches you how to talk to people. That teaches you how to interact. Just basic social skills uh, would be good for that deputy. Uh, it would be better if his ass was canned because that was totally inappropriate. And I hope that with him being the chief deputy, he does not field train any of your other deputies because he would be a bad example to look up to. I would like a comment and you can call me back at area code 518. Now the sheriff posted on Facebook that his office had been abused. You cannot watch that entire video. And if you do not get mad and upset at how those people were treated, something's wrong. A change is long overdue. Change needs to happen. Change needs to start in Meade County, Kentucky. So with getting no one to answer the questions that I have, I decided to give the circuit clerk's office a call. That video will be coming up just a little bit later. What's your thoughts on this video? Comment and let us know.